Okay, so looking in my pantry, um, I don't think I'm going to go, I mean, if you saw my ad, my grocery ad uh, video before this video, um, they have really great prices, um, really good prices at those two stores. However, I feel I have enough stuff between me and my husband. Now, you got to remember that we're empty nesters now. So our three sons, our youngest is 22. They all moved out. And not only did they, they used to live here uh, about seven or 10 miles away from us. They moved out from Central Valley to the East Bay. So they're about over an hour drive away from us. So they're not going to be popping in as often as they would, you know, being seven miles away from us. <clears throat> but I think this Sunday they'll officially be gone. Um, that's their day that they're moving everything out of the house or their apartment. But besides the point, um, this is what my husband and I have. My husband does not eat breakfast and he does not eat American style type breakfast if he were to. Being that he's from India, he doesn't eat cereal and milk. He doesn't eat oatmeal. He doesn't eat things like that. He'll eat things like uh, masala dosa or uh, Italy's with uh, coconut chutney or something like that. But his main meals are lunchtime and dinner time. So he doesn't eat the same way how I eat. So, um, I kind of like don't really eat too much cereal this time, but for my sons, um, I should probably pack up some things for them and, you know, I think that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to pack up stuff like this. Um, we don't make our own coffee. I don't drink coffee. My husband is addicted to the Seattle's best coffee at the local Chevron. So he goes there and buys uh, his coffee. That's one of his things he likes. So, okay, he can have that. And just get rid of these tortilla chips. And this is empty. This I should just toss. Uh, pancake mix. I should just pack it for the boys. These cereals here. This one isn't open. I use this to make Christmas wreaths. And I think I'm going to go ahead and donate it to our church. Uh, this being open, I'll just give it to my sons. Let's see. Yeah, see? Christmas wreath, Christmas wreath, so, anyways, so we have some of regular rice here, oh, and we have another marshmallows, that's going to get donated, and we have some um, opened up pasta, let's see, stuff here. We got croutons for salad. I think I'll keep these. My husband likes these. This was for our Christmas Day salad. I didn't even, I didn't even make the salad. <clears throat> and let's what else? I have some rye bread left. I have some spelt powder. I have an unopened old-fashioned oats container. I have some tahini sauce. I got some maple syrup. <sighs> Flour. Uh, lasagna. I got some of that cornmeal back there. Some tomato puree in a jar. Jackfruit. Canned jackfruit. Uh, that was not a hit with me. My daughter-in-law liked the jackfruit tamales. I did not like them. Um, tomato paste. Corn husk. Um, I don't need them. I'm not going to be making tamales anytime soon. I have another unopened pack of pasta I got some lentils here let's see what else do I have and then we have this sack of basmati rice right here which I think that's a, that's like maybe two pounds right there unopened corn tortillas I got a lot of beans black eyed beans another black eyed beans I got some quinoa some barley, another bag of barley, some dried beans, another dried bean package, and let's see, this is almost empty. This is basically my husband's, I call it his Indian section of uh, foods. So he's got his whole wheat flour to make his Indian breads and spices. 
<clears throat> and what else? We've got a bunch of things here and rice flour. And then down here we have some oranges my friend gave me and some potatoes and some rice and brown rice. And yeah, that's it for my pantry. Coming into my fridge. Let's see, this has to get discarded. We have uh, some chili, some unopened pack of spinach. We got some carrots, leftover hummus. There's one egg in here that'll be for Izzy. Cilantro, some onion. We got an open pack of corn tortillas. This is leftover masa, which I'm gonna. Well, I'm not gonna eat it, so it's gonna have to get tossed. Cucumber here, some tomatoes, eggplant, cauliflower, uh, a green leaf, and a red leaf lettuce. And we have some squash and some tomatoes in here. And then the rest is just kind of like condiment. There's hemp milk and stuff. So, yep, that's about it, friends. So I think I have enough foods that I don't need to go to the store this week. Even though I'm so tempted to go to the store and pick up some of those specials, but... You know, I'm not going to do it. I'm not going to give in to it. Um, here I have some avocados, a lime. I have a butternut squash. I have a couple of sweet potatoes and a lot of red onions. And we got garlic, an orange, a lime, a mango, two mangoes, some more avocados, and some little mini potatoes and garlic. So... Yeah, my, we have enough food to last us. Maybe we'll see what happens next Wednesday and um, see what, hopefully the sales ads will be nice. Um, you know, the sales ad will be nice or have some good sales. But till then, we're not going, I'm not going to go um, grocery shopping and do any shopping. I do want to try and keep our budget down and see how we can do. And um, mostly... Food budget goes to meat. My husband likes um, to eat chicken. He likes beef, pork. However, he doesn't eat as much and he doesn't cook as much now that the boys aren't home. He used to do a lot of his cooking because the boys loved his chicken curry. But there's nobody home anymore. So, and sometimes. Okay, friends. So, we did a lot of decluttering today. My back seat. Hopefully, you can see my back seat. And my trunk is full, too. Uh, I'll show you my trunk. Okay, so I'm on my way to... Um, I'm on my way to the thrift store. And I'm going to donate all these items I have in my car and my trunk. And not only am I going to get rid of it, I'm going to take a little peek inside and see what kind of things they have. And... Um, yeah, I'm starting up my decluttering, and no, I don't plan on bringing a bunch of junk back home with me. There's like a couple of things that I feel like I really need. Like, I'm really looking for some wool pants with silk lining. The pants I have are too small, so I'm trying to look for something like that. And um, I'm not too sure what else I might need. However, I can't wait till 2019 to uh, declutter and do spring cleaning so I started yesterday which was the 27th and uh, we need to do our garage inside my pantry's uh, cluttered my refrigerator is cluttered needs to be cleaned and organized upstairs everything needs to be organized so that's what I'm gonna spend um, my time today and until whenever I'm done and uh, I just want to declutter and get a lot of things out of my home and uh, just start fresh. So that's what I'm planning on doing. And right now I'm just on my way to the thrift store.
Ta-da! <laughs> I finally cleaned it out. It looks more sparse than it did earlier, but that's okay. Got the lettuce, apples, and then the tray down here. Well, at least it looks a bit more cleaner and neater now. Okay, friends, thanks for watching. Let's see what happens in the next video. Thanks for watching. Bye.